This is 10 News and a breakthrough by Melbourne researchers has given doctors hope it may lead to a cure for HIV. They've unlocked the secret of how the virus lies dormant in the body. Paul Kidd has been HIV positive for 25 years, a fact he says is worth celebrating. What I understood and what was the reality of HIV uh, uh, 15, 20 years ago was that it was a death sentence and usually it was quite a fast death, death sentence. Now a team of Melbourne researchers has renewed hope a cure could be in reach. They've unravelled the mystery in which the virus is able to transfer to cells where it lies dormant for years, uninhibited by drugs. It's infection of these resting cells that persist in patients on treatment. And in, the infection of resting cells is really the major barrier to curing HIV. The team at the Alfred's Burnett Institute has identified the family of proteins responsible. A world first breakthrough putting Australian researchers at the forefront of efforts to eradicate HIV. Now that scientists have unlocked the secrets of how the protein works, the race is on to develop a therapy to combat it. Clinical trials on a drug are likely to start next year, with a human trial likely in less than five. The aim is to block HIV entering cells in the first place, while activating the virus in those cells it's already penetrated, then blasting it with antivirals. Wake up those infected, those resting cells to make virus, and so the drugs can work on those resting cells. The once faint hope of an HIV-free future looks to be getting brighter. And the sooner that we can uh, move on to a situation in which people can actually be, be free of HIV, the better. Gerard Shulton, 10 News.